Okay, um, my name is Sarah Chadwick and I am the singer of Batrider. Uh, we are actually a New Zealand band and we moved here three years ago and we have had a good time in Australia but I think it's time for us to move on so we go to the UK in 10 days now and I haven't done anything so I'm very stressed out about it and yeah. Well my first album I ever had was a guy that I went to primary school with in New Zealand burnt me or made me a, a tape of Ace of Bass, his first album, or maybe only album. And then I bought um, Wilson Phillips, the cassette, and that was the first thing I had. I was from Tamaranui, there's like 3,000 people there, and it's like, yeah, basically that was all that we heard in there. <laughs> I think the first gig that I went to was probably one that we played it because me, our, our drummer that I'm that's in the band now, Tara and I, went to school together and we were in a band that did, there's like this big um, kind of battle of the bands competition for high school kids in New Zealand and like it's funny when everyone gets older because pretty much everyone who's in a band has been through that whole thing pretty much and so we, yeah, the first gig we probably went to was like one that about 5,000 people were at that we were playing at so yeah, but then, and we used to go to lots of like local kind of stuff at the place that we were at, so yeah. We, oh, we just had our last gig really. Um, it's quite bad because we play with quite a bit and so heaps of time, or oh, usually it's only our gigs or our friends gigs that we end up going to. But um, I don't really haven't been to any like internationals or anything since we've been here. I, I saw Cat Power play and it was really traumatic and I cried afterwards because she didn't play any songs pretty much and then uh, and I saw Stephen Malkmus play that's pretty much the only big acts I've seen since I've been in Australia and then yeah we had our last gig an acoustic gig at Manchester Lane at a place in the city and yeah it was really cool well the last album oh, I was probably the latest Elliot Smith that one that came out New Moon I think it's called but I downloaded it I didn't buy it <laughs> But um, yeah, and it's really good, I really like it. I didn't like it at first, but then the more I listen to it, the more I like it. Probably either, yeah, like I'm a big Elliot Smith and Cat Power fan, so probably either, uh, what would the community think, Cat Power, or either or Elliot Smith. So yeah. Playing in Adelaide at this place called Urtex that they've got up there, it's like a big kind of warehousey gallery space that they've had going in. Last time we played there, like people were crowd surfing and stuff, so that was pretty cool. Or else playing in um, Hobart on the last tour that we played, and there'd been like a zombie march or something in the daytime, so everyone had kind of gone to the pub and kept drinking there until the gig started and people were dressed up as zombies or whatever. If I had to do um, a duet with one person, I would probably say my friend Matt Benham is in a band called No Thorough. And um, I covered one of his songs for him, and he covered one, one of mine. And I would probably choose to do the cover version of the song that I did of his with him, because I reckon it would be really cool. cool. Yeah. <laughs> so it's got other songs called Crush This Town. Yeah. Great. Thanks, Sarah. Hi, thank you very much.